Today we will be opening the oldest Yu-Gi-Oh packs. What's up guys? We are back with another epic legacy pack opening. Today we have a ton of legacy packs. We're talking like almost 40 packs. I have five Legend of Blue Eyes, three Metal Raiders, four Invasion of Chaos. Then we have, I think it's 15 Dark Crisis. That's going to be fun. Then we have some blisters, Dark Crisis, Dark Crisis with some extra cards. We got another Dark Crisis with extra cards, another one. So a lot of Dark Crisis today, almost a booster box. We got those, we got those, and then here's a big one, the Legend of Blue Eyes. Very nice. Those extra cards could have a Ghost Rare. It's happened to me before. Then we have a double pack of Invasion of Chaos and I think Metal Raiders, so that's a good one. And then another one of those. So we have an absolute ton of awesome packs to open. But before all that, we do have a giveaway from the guy I bought these from. This is the same guy that we did the Magic Ruler Spell Ruler. I think it's Northern Cards Collectibles. I think. I'm going to put it, put it up on the screen just so I don't mess it up exactly because you know how it is with Instagram handles. Hard to remember the exact name. Here's a giveaway number one. You guys can win. So, oh, a secret edition movie pack, some Sisters of the Rose, Secret Slayers, Infinity Chasers. Wow, that's really cool. A lot of booster packs. Giveaway number two. Is this going to be more packs? Like, does that mean two winners, I guess is what he means? So, two winners for the giveaway. He will also be in another video because he's getting more Magic Ruler packs from me. Ooh, Fusion Trike. That's a new Pokemon set. Metazoo. This is the first time I've ever held a Metazoo pack. And then we've got some sleeves. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite pack open today or what you want to win in the giveaway. All right, guys, now it's time to open the oldest Yu-Gi-Oh packs. I'm so excited. We're going to start off with a Dark Crisis because we do have a lot of these. So what we're looking for out of Dark Crisis because we have a lot of these packs, Skill Drain is a $10 rare. We could also get Final Countdown. It's a couple dollars for a common. And then finally, there's the, uh, what is it called? The, uh, I just forgot. Well, there's the Exodia Necross. Then there's the card that we pulled, Shinado. There we go. We got a PSA 10 on it, which was really cool at first edition. Dark Bishop Archfiend, Blind the Little Goblin, and Little Wingard. Right, let's try another one. That Shinado was really awesome. I now own two PSA 10s, which is funny. One I pulled and graded myself, and one I bought from Cool Trainer Ryan a couple of years ago. We got a Kelbeck. DD Warrior Lady, one of the better supers. Nice. It's a very battle scarred. We got that one. We love that card. This is a good GOAT format card. Just a very strong card in older formats. Right, let's switch it up. Invasion of Chaos. Let's try this. Can we pull? The Black Luster. It's hard to believe we have not pulled that card. So we're going to continue trying Sea Server Warrior of Darkness, Raikoki, Gigantis, and Destruction Ring. We're looking for Manjus as well. Terror King and Chaos Necromancer. A little bit of a slow start. We did get a DD Warrior Lady, which is not bad. Let me know in the comments how many secrets, how many ultras, and how many supers will we pull. This is a lot of packs. There's a Berserk Dragon. Very nice. Legendary Flame Lord, Gaga Gigo. And Final Countdown. There's a good one. Okay, a couple of good cards in the pack. It's time for a Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let's do this, Skull Red Bird. We could pull the Blue Eyes White Dragon, which even in these reprint packs is absolutely expensive and absolutely awesome. Dark Magician, we got the Man Eater. Here we go. Hinotama, inflict 500 points of damage to your opponent's life points. We got the Metal Dragon, Dragon Treasure, Kumitoko, Beaver Warrior, and the Silver Fang. Not a bad start, we're doing okay. We got a couple of decent commons, or a couple, or one, I think. And then we got a couple of foils, Token Thanksgiving. We got a Checkmate, Chelsea just called me, Frozen Soul, Rod of Silence, Chaos, Different Dimension Gate, Scorpion, Zolga, Battle Scarred, and the Goblin of Greed. We are back after answering Chelsea's phone call. Let's see what we can pull. Maybe she's giving us some luck by calling. Let's see. We got the Pandemonium, Frozen Soul, Acrobat Monkey, Bottle Footballer, Des Feral Imp. Okay, it's delayed luck. We will see. It's delayed luck. It will happen eventually. Let's go into a Metal Raiders. We have not opened one yet. Pale Yugi. If you ever have a reprint pack, it's always Pale Yugi. We got the Punished Eagle. We got the Baby Dragon, Bistro Butcher. Soul Release and the Witch's Apprentice. All right, Insect Soldiers of the Sky, Niwatori, and the Cheerful Coffin. Give us something big. Can we pull an epic, ultra rare, secret rare? Vampire Lord, come on. Token Thanksgiving. Checkmate. Frozen Soul. Ooh, a Mirage Knight. So we're getting a lot of supers in this one. Okay, very nice. Mirage Knight. Dark, Dark Crisis has three supers. Nothing else has pulled anything. That's interesting. All right, Death's Fair Olymp again. We got the Blinded Little Goblin and the Guardian Axe Grawl. Let's try another Invasion of Chaos, please. Can we pull it? The Legendary. Grand Majude Aiza? No. Heart of the Underdog? Be gone, Nave. And... Ooh, a Dark Magician of Chaos! <laughs> we cannot pull the BLS, but man, can we pull the Dark Magician of Chaos. We have pulled this guy in my life. I think I've pulled this over 10 times. That's a lot, because it's a great card. We will take... I'm never going to complain pulling this, but it is funny how often I pull this, and I can never pull BLS. It is so weird. Okay, well, good... Chelsea brought us that delayed luck there. Pretty good. Let's go. Contract. Acrobat Monkey. DD Trainer. 
Dark Scorpion Chick the Yellow. Dez Feral Imp, Rod of Silence, or Rod of the Mind's Eye, not, not Chaos, it's a different card. Let's go into another Legend of Blue Eyes. Let's do this. Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, Black Dragon, Monster Reborn, anything. Raigeki would be awesome. Tatsumi Giant, Laser Cannon Armor. Ooh, the Flame Swordsman, the Super Strike again. That's a pretty good one. I will take that. Two-pronged attack, Fiend Reflection number two, Violent Crystal, Sandstone, Numuko. This is going pretty well. We are pulling some good cards. We have not pulled a Secret Rare yet, so that's our last rarity that we need. Shinado, Shinado's Arc, Pandemonium Watch Bear, Shadow Knight, Archfiend. A Mudora, another Super out of these. Despair and Contract with Exodia, maybe that means we will pull the Exodia Necros. Let's try another one. I'm feeling the Necros, the power of the Necros. Let's go. Contract with a Dark Master. That's Zork. Okay, a little bit different. DD Trainer and Dark Scorpion Chick the Yellow. Archfiend Soldier. That's a cool card. I always did love that one. 1900 beater. Very easily accessible. Let's try another Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Here we go. The Beast Fangs. Spike Seedra. Trial of Nightmare, the uh, eroded version, or the uh, different name, whatever you call that. Follow Wind, and Giant Soldier of Stone, Numiruko, and Furious Seeking. All right, all right. Let's keep it up. We've gotten a lot of foils today. I'm happy about this. The commons and rares could step it up, so let's get ourselves a skill drain. That'd be cool. That could be in the same pack as a foil, which would be awesome. Fear from the Dark, Little Wind Guard, and Cyber Raider. Let's go into an Invasion of Chaos. Guys. Brothers of Legend comes out next week. Can you guys believe how many new sets there have been? Ghost from the Past coming out with just crazy Ghost Rare. Man, I'm so excited. Smashing Ground, Gora, Turtle of Illusion. Blasting the Ruins. And the Sasuke Samurai number three. Torpedo Fish. Okay, okay. Back to Old Faithful Dark Crisis, which has pulled us a bunch of super rares. Kelbeck. Non-spellcasting area. Archfiend's Oath. And the Metalizing Parasite Lunatite falling down. And a ray of hope. We have a ray of hope that we will pull something legendary. To another Blue Eyes White Dragon pack. Come on. We haven't opened a lot of LOB recently. We usually open a lot, but we have not recently. So we need something big. Petite Dragon. Let's get an Ultra Rare. Silver Bow and Arrow. Here we go. It looks like something. It's... Okay. Polymerization. Raigeki. Monster Reborn. Which will it be? Or Swords of Light. Monster Reborn! Yes! The best one. The Ultra Rare. Okay, you could argue maybe Red Geki is cooler, but this is a very good one. I've pulled this a lot out of the reprint packs. Monster Reborn, that is a very cool card. I love that one. Metal, Metal Dragon, not Metal Raiders. Okay, a little different. Time for a Dark Crisis. We've got Keldo. Dragon Down on the Grave. Rod of Silence Cased. Exodia Necros! I called it! I sensed the Dark Lord Exodia Necros. Here we go. Very nice. That is awesome. Exodia Necros. Who remembers the video where we pulled two of these out of the original Unlimited packs? That's a fantastic pull. Pulls have been amazing so far today. Wow, that's awesome. Battle Scarred. We got the uh, Deal with the Dark Ruler. On that note, I think it's time to crack into some of these blisters. We do have a few other of the loose packs, but we're going to crack into the blisters because we are on fire right now. Is this the day where we get the card we've been searching for? Black Luster Soldier. All right, we got a uh, Phantom Knights of Fragile Armor. Cool. Oh, there's two IOC in these. That's amazing. Okay, we'll take that. Two IOC in the blister pack. Zero Gravity, more chances of BLS. Inferno. Pinch Hopper. Blasting the Ruins, and Getsufuma, Don Turtle, Chopman the Desperate Outlaw. Dark Crisis, you have treated us well. Now bless us with another epic monster. Archfiend's Oath, Dark Scorpion Manet, non-spellcasting area. Contract with the Dark Master, Wicked Flimberg Bow, and Gaga Go. Next, Invasion of Chaos Pack. Let's do this. Multiplication of Ants, Hero Emerges, Stumbling, Pinch Hopper, we have the Ultra Evolution Pill, Dawn Turtle, Granadora, Chopman the Desperate Outlaw yet again. Let's try Dark Crisis again. We have so many of these, we got to go a couple in a row. Let's see if we can pull. Now we just need the Shinado. We need the Shinado Pandemonium. Ooh, Terror King Archfiend. We're going to pull the whole foil set. Guy got Geek Go yet again. We've like almost pulled all the supers, maybe like half of them. It feels like a lot. Terror King Archfiend. 
But now we have this. These are fun because they do have these random cards that are usually terrible, but occasionally you can get a ghost rare. I've gotten a ghost rare and I, someone else told me that they got a ghost rare. And I was like, yeah, I believe you because I did that too. <laughs> Let's see what the random cards are. Oh, these are very bent. Those have to be them. So these are the non foils recycling batteries classic and then very very bent dark greffer is actually pretty cool and then sky striker mecha eagle booster very cool just a little bit pringly there onto the pack what will be inside let's see what we can grab the frozen soul acrobat monkey battle footballer shinado's arc mephis the infernal general morale boost despair from the dark battle scarred and the arsenal robber Let's try another Legend of Blue Eyes. Here we go. What will be inside? We have a Root Water is inside. Him, Warrior number two. The Larvas. And the Petite Dragon. A hard body and the Armored Starfish. All right. Larvas didn't give us anything. Let's see if we can do another. Let's open another one of these with Dark Crisis inside. Will it have... Oh, there it is. Spoiler. Priestess with Eyes of Blue. That's not a bad card, actually. X Saber Axel, all right, and then the Performal Pal Spike Eagle, Christron, and Artifact Chakra. Dark Crisis, here we go. Let's see. Drag down to the grave. We got the Outstanding Dog Marin, Chelsea's favorite card. We got the Non Spell Casting Area, and oh. Spell Vanishing. I thought it might be the Judgment of Anubis for a second. Spell Vanishing Super Rare. What did I tell you? We're pulling the entire foil set, or at least the Super Rare set. I just counted. We have six of the Supers. Different Supers. That's insane. The randomness is like, it's not, it's, it, it seems like you would have gotten a repeat or like something else, but we are just pulling Super Rares over and over. Dragon Piper. Here's Metal Raiders. We haven't opened a lot of this. Tainted Wisdom. Here we go. Seven colored fish. How many colors are on that fish? Just ask john house of champs all right let's go another random pack okay let's try not to spoil the excitement here let's go like this we've got the pack we've got these which are super heavy samurai raid raptor gradle okay what are these side frame driver okay not bad in the tg1 and position actually decent okay not terrible let's go into the actual pack let's do this incandescent ordeal ultra for tribute gravity axe girl DD Morley, we finally got a double, but we got another super. That's actually a pretty good one to get a double of. We finally got a double after six unique supers on the same set, which is hilarious. We, I mean, we haven't even opened that many packs. We've opened like maybe 15, and we've pulled seven supers and an ultra. That's pretty good. Archfiend's World, we got another one here. Cessus of Dagla. Sakuretsu Armor, that's a good one. Different Dimension Gate. We have not pulled a single skill drain, though. All right, we still got a lot of packs left here, so this is uh, this is going pretty well. I'm enjoying it. It's pretty fun. We have the pack, and then we have... Oh, Dual Terminal! That's actually sick! Argin X Turbo. I think this is considered like a common, though, but that is still really cool. And then an Archfiend of Guilford. That's actually really cool. I like this. This is much cooler than what you usually get. Very cool. Solomon Great Wolvie, I see. I remember this card uh, from playing it for a second. What is happening there? There's a big furry guy with a mouth. That is strange. Let's get into the actual pack. Pretty cool. Dual terminal cards. That's awesome. Let's go. Battle Footballer. Shinado's Ark. Pandemonium Watch Bear. Shadow Knight Archfiend. Great Maju Garzette. Very cool. Ninken Dog and Mustering of the Dark Scorpion. We are getting down to the end of our Dark Crisis packs. We do still have an Invasion of Chaos, a Metal Raiders, and a Legend of Blue Eyes to finish out. DD Trainer. Guardian Chaist. Ojama Trio and the Contact with the Abyss. Let's go. Now, bless us with ex epic extra cards. The extra cards are the Celestial Double Star Shaman and the Infernoid Deviata. Okay. Dark Contract with the Gate. Cool. Some DDD cards. Oh, Torrentials. No, that's not a bad card. White Stone of Legend from Crossroads of Chaos. Zombie World. Hey, these cards are not bad. Fiendish Chain goes in match. A lot of... Okay, this is... That's not bad. These are some pretty good cards. Another Dark Crisis. It's been good to us so far. Only one Ultra, though. Can we get a secret? Or another Ultra. Frozen Soul. Rod of Silence Cased. Shadow Knight Archfiend and the Guardian Trice. Very nice. Final countdown. We finally got a second one of these. Our last Dark Christ. Oh, we have a double blister of Invasion of Chaos. We still have three packs of that left. Nice. Okay. Spoilers here. Oh, it's just a regular rare. I hate when they do this. I like, guess it's going to be a foil. No, it's a regular rare. Handcuffs Dragon. Oh, Duelist Genesis. Cool. Cyber Phoenix. What is that from? DPO4. Big Bang Shot, Falling Down. Wait, is that from Dark Crisis? No, DR1. Nice. That's old. Sometimes you'll get some really old cards in there, which is pretty funny. 
Let's go into the Crisis. Oh, John Mastrios. This is the last pack of Dark Crisis. It's been so good to us. Dark Scorpion. Will it end on a banger? Shadow Knight, Arch Fiend, and Death's Fair Limb. It will not, but it did well. Oh, final countdown. Pretty good. All right. Double Invasion of Chaos. Plus a bonus card. So it's, it's pretty big value here. We have the same card. Okay, they tend to do that. Put the same cards in there. This is what we have left. Three Invasion of Chaos, a Metal Raiders, and finally this. Let's see what the bonus cards are inside before we open the last five packs. Here we go. Oh, come on. Giving us rares. What a bummer. Some more. Okay, cool. And Hexa Link. Final five packs. Let's go with Invasion of Chaos because we do have three of these. It's been a good one so far. We've had some pretty good luck. We've cooled down a little bit. But let's just end it with something big. Stealth Bird, Soul Tiger. Yes! Black Luster Soldier! We did it! Yes! I didn't think there was anything in there. It didn't look like suspicious or anything at all. Black Luster Soldier! We finally done it! Oh my goodness! I had a good feeling about this video. We're just pulling so many good cards. It had to happen eventually. The Black Luster Soldier. Thanks again to Northern Card Collectibles for selling me these packs because these are the packs that did it. We pulled the Black Luster Soldier. Yes! So we pulled two of the three. We just need CED to have all three of the big three now. We've never done that, obviously, because we've never pulled Black Luster Soldier until now. Yes. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. It finally happened. Oh, my goodness. Amazing. Amazing. Primal Seed. Gale Lizard. Ojami Yellow. Stray Lamb. Sophie Sup. Why do these look like super faded? I don't know. They look kind of faded. We're going to save this one last for the trifecta because we could potentially get the CED as well. Let's go to Metal Raiders. Hasn't done much for us today. Let's see. Oh, ha, ha. and there it is. It was called out. Brought us the best card in the set. The Bikanio Moth. Blue Wing Crown. Big Eye. Germ Infection and Hoshingen. Okay, we got the best card in the set. Legend of Blue Eyes. Two more packs. I can't believe we finally pulled Black Luster Soldier. And it late, left it to the last five packs. Or was it the last four packs of a 39-pack opening? Root Water. And we're in number two. Best video ever! The blue eyes! I should have opened that last! Oh! <laughs> that was in the blister too! Blue eyes, white dragon! Black Luster Soldier! Exodia Necros! Unbelievable! What an. Oh, don't forget Pecania Moth. What an unbelievable opening! Fissure! I, I really want to post this. We're doing a live stream tomorrow. This is a Wednesday live stream, so I can't post it tomorrow. Maybe we'll post it Thanksgiving. You know, everyone be thankful for this. All. I'm thankful for my BLS pool. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Final pack. Can we get the trifecta? I don't think it could possibly get better than this opening. Literally the best opening ever. <laughs> Gale Lizard. Uh, which we've had some good reprint openings, but this is the top one. This is crazy. A hero emerges. It was an ultra. I thought it was. I thought it was gonna be a Chaos Emperor Dragon Guardian Angel. Angel, Angel Joan. This was an incredible opening. Insane. We have to do a recap. We don't usually do recaps anymore. Oh, there's a compulse, but we will recap the best cards. Oh my goodness. That's all I have to say here. And of course, the best one there is. What an amazing video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe to the channel because there will be more openings like this. This was completely amazing. Shout out to TCG, Trusted Cards, Tone Fo Show, Tomato Juice, Noah J, Hawaiian Yu-Gi-Oh, Stanley Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, and Duelist Kingdom Cards. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I will see you guys next time for more epic videos. Peace.